Hi, this is Jeff Sloss. I'm at the Zoller Video Lab here in Louisville, Kentucky. We're going to talk about the Aquanaut Key 507 battery backup sump pump system. Uh, this system is our entry level in our Aquanaut line. We, we sell it in two versions. One is the straight system, which is a 507-0005. And then we do sell it in a pro pack also with our M73 pump, and that is a 507-0013. So by way of introduction, let's look at the components here. We've got a 507 pump. We have a, a, a thread in check valve that will go into your primary pump. There's a clamp and a T for your piping, your discharge piping. The pump itself does have a check valve built into it, so that's, that's where the T would go above the two check valves. You have an operational float switch, a battery box, and the controller itself. So just uh, what we'll do is we'll compare some of these features uh, with the other systems and then look at each component and some of its uh, independent features. So the pump itself compares to our 508 pump. The 508 pump is what comes with our Aquanaut spin and our Aquanaut fit systems. And you can tell there's a size difference. Um, the, the main difference though is that this is gonna do about 12 gallons a minute at 10 feet. This is gonna do more like 34 gallons a minute. So this is more like a primary sump pump uh, per performance. Whereas this would be more appropriate and this system would be more appropriate for somebody with a, uh, let's say quieter or less active sump pit. The operational float switch would use a clamp and it would be clamped onto the pipe. And then you can raise and lower that float switch to a, a level that's appropriate. And the ball float rises up, clicks it on, falls back down as the water is being pumped and clicks it off. So you have an adjustability here with the stopper and adjustability where it is on the pipe. The battery box has these easy lock tabs on the side. There's also a, a spot here on the side. You can't really see it in the video, but there's a place where you could lock this box out if you didn't want somebody getting into it. And do note that our battery backup systems are not sold with the battery that would be contained in here. We do sell batteries, of course, uh, but it doesn't come with the systems. The controller does self-test. So what that means is it's going to run the pump, it's gonna spin it, pump water if there's water in the tank and no water if there isn't, but by, by spinning it each day, it's making sure that that impeller doesn't get crusted up with the minerals that are in the water so it will self-test on its own each day. You can also go down and push the test button. Now, when you push the test button, say you push the test button at 3 p.m., that kind of resets the counter. And, and now every day at around 3 p.m. is when your self-test will be. So that's a kind of a way to dictate when the testing occurs every day. There's also a silence button on the controller. There's one pro pack that includes the Aquanaut Key 507, and that would be the 507 0013. That pro pack includes the M73 pump, which is our uh, an entry level primary sump pump that pumps around 30 gallons a minute at a 10 foot lift. So obviously when it's a pro pack, it is assembled together so that you can take it out of the box and install it right away. So if you have any other questions about the Aquanaut Key 507 or any of our other battery backup systems, just go to zollerpumps.com or visit our YouTube channel.